The Lagos State Government has assured residents of Gerard Road, Ikoi, that safety standards will be employed during the destruction of the two buildings left. This was stated at a meeting with stakeholders and residents of the area before the planned demolition. BBC News correspondent Theophilos Elama reports. In November last year, a high-rise block of luxury flats under construction in the neighborhood of Ikui in Lagos, Nigeria, collapsed. At least 42 people died from the incident, which left many shocked. Immediately, the Lagos State Government inaugurated the committee to investigate the cause of the incident. <laughs> Almost a year down the line, the government has resolved to demolish the two other high-rise buildings within the vicinity after it failed an integrity test. Hence the need to meet with residents to assure them of safety during the process. You will agree with me it's a long process and it starts to be done properly. And for us to do that, we will have to study a lot of reports, study a lot of situations, and even coming up with the right consultant, this right person to do the job, should take a lot of time. So we need to do our due diligence very well to be able to do a good job. What we have chosen is what we call a non-explosive approach. As you know, we could use explosives and then implosion and all that. There are so many technical methods, but we have chosen a non-explosive method to avoid you know, let, let me even say that the word explosion has its own psychological effect. And therefore, we've tried to avoid this. The government also says measures have been put in place to ensure reduction of building collapse in the state. We are going to ensure safety of life and properties. All the key stakeholders that are important in managing emergency in Lagos State will be on the ground for 24 hours. And believe me, I have moved the command control center to the place. From Thursday, all the peripheral of emergency will be on the ground. We have been talking to people, we've kept talking to developers and to build right, use the right professionals in their construction works, use the right materials, to get their approvals and let's allow LAPCA to do to grant authorization and do all the state certification. So with that, we should be able to to, to limit uh, collapse in the state. The state government says it is concerned about the safety of residents, hence the need to assure them as controlled demolition that will commence soon. Theophilus Ilama, TVC News, Lagos.